and welcome to another video. Today I am doing a Nerdy Work Grand unboxing, which you probably all know is one of my favourites by now. I'm really, really excited to open this one because the theme for this month, I believe, was magical beasts or magical creatures or something and I am excited obviously so I don't want to do too much rambling I do just really want to get into this because I can't wait to see what's inside as always first off I'm just going to open it for you and you'll see the magazine on top oh, 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 oh. Ah, there it is got the owl hoots magazine magical beasts november 2016 not gonna read it obviously because it has spoilers for the month but i'll just set it to one side and then um, we can go through this tissue with the little sticker as usual can you see can you see Ooh, how exciting let's go okay so the first thing i see poking through the worms is this tiny little polka dot bag it feels quite heavy actually let's have a look it's a candle magic zoology so it's like the zoology of magical creatures this is made by stacks of wax that's a cool name and board in cheshire the study of magical creatures yes that is what it says bergamot orange amber coconut almond vanilla soy wax <sighs> that smells really good special edition it smells really good i do quite like the scent of that one. Oh, I've got wax on my nose. It's cute. It's very nicely with the theme. I'll just pop that there for now and dig further through the worms. Oh, I see stuff. Magical Beasts, exclusive for Nerdy Bookworm Box. And this is a set of three pins. This is adorable. Without stories, we wouldn't be human beings at all. That's what the red one says. Everything has a meaning if only we could read it what the blue one says you cannot change who you are only what you do that's what the green one says they're really cute i like them are they quotes from something or i don't know i feel like they're probably quotes from something and i just am not picking up what let me have a look it's not in here it says mystery item this month we featured a mystery item from the talented creator of meraki candles is that this maybe i'll find out at the end when i've gone through all the items to see if the mystery item would fit anything else but um i think that might be the mystery item i do really like the bins though they are sweet little bins next <sighs> believe in yourself and it's a little unicorn coaster this is adorable <laughs> i really like this so cute there's not really much else i can say about that it's not like, related to anything but it's just a little coaster. I like that a lot. Next, A to Z of Unicorns from Neon Magpie. And it looks like these are colouring postcards. Yes, they are. So you've got a little unicorn there, a unicorn on a witch's broomstick, a unicorn going scuba diving, a unicorn on the moon, and a unicorn as a mermaid. They're adorable. I really really like those and I know exactly who I'm going to send some of them to. <laughs> Next is House of Wonder A6 notepad and it's got little dinosaurs or di are they dinosaurs? Dinosaurs, monsters, you are rawsome it says in the top corner there. That's really cute. Notes and other important stuff. I am a lover of notepads obviously <laughs> so um this goes down well with me. Next is the book. It's massive. As usual, it's in the brown paper with its little blue sticker that says happy reading, which is adorable. Details are everything with this box, tied up in string. And this month, we don't have a little charm to give us a clue about what the book is. Unfortunately, I enjoy the little charms, but you know, never mind, not mad. Let's untie her and see what it is. I've got the string off. Let's unstick the sticker oh my god i'm excited before i show you the book as usual we have the nerdy bookworm um bookmark that matches the um art print for the month and the quest card with the exclusive online content so i'll keep hold of those and this book cover is beautiful 
don't even know if you can see it because of how reflective it is. So this is Moon Chosen by PC Cast. And I am certain I've heard of this before. Yes, I knew it. I knew I had. In one of the owl crate boxes, we got this little passport. Passport to a new world. And it was um, a little advertising thing for Moon Chosen. And here is Moon Chosen. What are the chances of that? One box advertises it, one box gives it to you. But yeah, this is Moon Chosen by PC Cast. And the cover is so pretty. I'm not sure if you can see it, but it's like rainbow kind of holographic. And it's got, I don't know what creature that is. Is it a wolf or something on the front there? It's got the face of like wolf or something there, could be a bear, not really sure. <laughs> also, it's got those um, edges that Three Dark Crowns had from Outgrate as well, where it's all jagged. Oh my goodness, it's a beautiful book. Tales of a New World number one. So it's part of a series. Oh my god, I'm so excited. I actually think of all of the book, this might be a bold statement actually, but of all of the books I've received in book boxes, this is one I'm most excited about. I cannot wait to read this, and I don't even know what it's about yet. Let's have a read. <laughs> Mary is an earthwalker, heir to the unique healing powers of her clan, but she has been forced to turn from her duties until she is chosen by a special animal ally, altering her destiny forever. When a deadly attack tears her world apart, Mary reveals the strength of her powers and the forbidden secret of her dual nature as she embarks on a mission to save herself and her people. It is not until Nick, the son of the leader from a rival dominating tribe, strays across her path that Mary experiences something she has never felt before. Now evil is coming, and with it a force more terrible and destructive than the world has ever seen, leaving Mary to cast a shadow from the earth. By breaking clan law and forming an alliance with Nick, she must make herself ready. Ready to save her people. Ready to save herself and Nick. Ready to embrace her true destiny and battle the forces that threaten to destroy them all. <sighs> yeah, I'm excited and I really want to read it. Oh really excited. As the dust jacket's so pretty, let's just have a look under it. Okay, just plain black and the spine has like the metallic teal. Moon chosen by PC Cast. It's really pretty. Not as pretty as the dust jacket though, the dust jacket is beautiful. Super excited by this. That is everything in the box which does lead me back to Pins. This must be the mystery item from Marathi Candles. Lovely job. Yeah, this is this is a good good box. I'm really really pleased with everything in here. The little coaster's adorable. The believe in yourself coaster. Cute little notepad. Bookmark and the cross card, obviously. Mermaid unicorn postcards and the other unicorn postcards and my zoology candle, which really does smell lovely. Love a good candle. But obviously the star of the show is the book and I'm super 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 excited to read this in fact it might push its way up onto um, next on my list because it just sounds so amazing and I'm so excited okay I'm gonna stop rambling about it now and um, I need to clean up the worms because as always I've thrown them all over the floor because I just get so excited <laughs> I'm going to start tidying up. Uh, if you've enjoyed this video and this unboxing, please do give it a thumbs up. If you would like to have a chat, talk to me down in the comments. And if you fancy subscribing, I am always eternally grateful for that. And I will see you next time. Bye!